So this is a controller that I got with my Xbox Series X, so it's just a typical Xbox One controller, it's the new version. And this is a $5 controller I got off of eBay. This is like what you would get if you went to your friend's house like years and years ago and you were the Player 2 controller. So yeah, $5 on eBay versus a $90 controller. So this is all Australian dollars. So I'm going to be playing Dark Souls 1 with this controller to see if it affects my performance. Now as you can see, it's like a PS3 ripoff. Now, I can usually get to Animal Londo in about an hour, or like 45 minutes type deal, using this controller. So we're going to use this controller. I'm going to see if it actually affects my performance, having a very cheap controller. Let's do this. Okay, so, as you gathered by the title and that intro, I am going to be playing Dark Souls... Remastered, unfortunately I'm playing the remastered, I'm just doing my typical character setup, give me a sec, done, Raylan, there she is, my girl, so yeah, I, I'm just gonna be playing Dark Souls 1, I'm, with the Xbox One controller, I'm usually fairly alright at this game. I'm not going to say I'm like a speedrunner or anything. But yeah, this controller cost me $5 on eBay, so I'm going to just see how it goes, if it affects my performance. And if it does, that'll be very interesting to me. So, just doing my usual game start run here. Oh my god, does anyone remember Mad Cats? That's what this controller feels like. It feels like the original PlayStation 2 or original Xbox, like, Mad Cats controller that, like, every kid on the block had back in the day. Oh, man, if you were Player 2 back in, like, 2005, like, you were having a bad time. You were having a bad time in 2005 if you were Player 2. So I'm just going to do my usual sort of route that I take to get to Anor Londo, and I'm going to end this recording once I get to Anor Londo. Because that's usually a pretty good area. <clears throat> and if this controller affects my performance too much, then we'll cut the playthrough- oh my god, I cannot aim. Yeah, well, if this controller affects my performance too much, then I will end the playthrough at, um, the Iron Golem. Because that's also... Oh my god, these buttons feel horrible. There we go. That is the first time I have taken damage from anything in this area in a very long time. Oh my god, this inputs feel so bad. It's so jank. It's so jank! Oh my god, yep. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. So, the true test for this controller will be the, um, Black Knight down in... Oh my god, I'm actually taking damage here. This is insane. Uh, already, this controller feels like crap. See, like, $5 Australian is, like, like $3 US or something? I don't know. This is just the absolute cheapest controller I could find on eBay. And I thought it would be really fun... To just try and do a run of Dark Souls with this controller. Because it's a very precision based game in terms of combat. And this is actually like honestly like my favorite game ever made. Like I love Dark Souls 1. I've been doing a lot of... I've been doing a lot of runs recently. Just sort of doing funny little setups and like dumb challenges for myself. But the reason I decided to do this is because I was like, you know what? I wonder if a $5 controller actually affects performance or if that's just like some sort of rumor or myth or gaming bullcrap. Oh man, it already feels bad. It's like, imagine a PS3 controller if like it had a baby with, like, a Mad Cats controller. 
It feels very... Oh my god, it feels bad. It actually feels horrible to use this controller. I wish I could explain it. I'm already noticing some, like, input delay. Like, actual input delay, which I've never had on a controller before. So I'm doing my typical... So my typical runs of Dark Souls 1 are just pure strength. Nothing else. I don't upgrade health, I don't upgrade endurance, I just run through the game on a pure strength using... A, this time I'm using uh, Depraved. I've done it um, with like Warrior, Build, and Bandit. But I'm using Depraved this time because I thought, you know what, Depraved would be really, really interesting for doing a run with a $5 controller. So I'm already can tell you I'm not worrying about the Firekeeper Soul that is down there because holy crap there is no point. Like there is actually no point in even attempting that Firekeeper Soul. I know I'm going to die like immediately. Oh wow this is bad. This is bad. I'm just trying to like steer my character. I'm just trying to run! This is me trying to just move normally and it's like janking out. I'm just trying to go straight. Just let me go straight. Holy crap. How do you screw up making a controller this bad? This has no brand on it by the way. Like actually zero branding. This is an- oh my god I'm gonna fall off the cliff. Please don't fall off the cliff. <coughs> the Black Knight. Um, down here will be the ultimate test. <laughs> because he's already, like, kind of necessary for certain setups in, um, and speedrunning. So, it'll be interesting to see how I go fighting him. And, um, before anyone, like, gets in the comments and is like, Oh, you're playing Dark Souls Remastered? Like, it's inferior, it's crap. Oh my god, go through the door. Um, it's inferior, it's in crap and everything. Um, the only reason I'm playing the remastered version is because my vanilla version of Prepare to Die Edition is currently, like, modded to hell right now. Like, I'm doing a playthrough of a modded version of that game that I found that is really interesting. Uh, I think it's called Daughters of Ash or something. Um, so if you're interested in that, like, look it up. It's real good fun. It kind of rearranges everything. <laughs> okay, so coming through here... This is gonna be the ultimate test. This guy here- oh my god, I can't dodge. I can't dodge. Oh my god, the input delay. Oh my god, the input delay. Get off the wall! Get off the wall! Oh man, this is- this is- oh, it's harrowing. Usually I- come on, there we go. Yes, we got the backstab. We finally got the backstab. So playing a pure strength depraved build is like already hard enough. In terms of the particular route that I take. Th this is my usual route in the game, by the way. I, I, I like to go fight the Gargoyles first. I think they're one of the best fights. Oh, we got another back... Oh, we're going for it. We're actually getting the backstabs. We're actually pulling it off. Oh, it's so hard trying to just go one direction. I'm just trying to go one direction and it's so bad. Oh, why did you- why did you do a lunge attack? I didn't tell you to do that. I didn't tell you to do- DODGE DAMN IT! DODGE OFF! I'm like, clicking the buttons. I'm- I'm seriously, I'm clicking the buttons, and it's- it's real bad. It's like a half- it's like half a second to a full second after, like, when you want to do an action is when it's actually happening. Oh my god, lock on. Lock on! What are you doing? Controller! Come on, man! I usually don't- I- I swear to god. I'm actually doing, like, way- way worse than usual. Oh, that we actually got a dodge. We actually pulled a dodge off. And a backstab. Holy crap! Oh, is there- is there hope? Is there hope? Is there hope? If we can just get rid of this- if we can just get rid of this knight. If we can just get rid of this knight. Come on, man. I'm gonna go grab my souls just because this controller is so unpredictable that I know I'm gonna lose them otherwise. And leveling is actually something I'm gonna need in this run. Because of the jank. 
because of the jank. Oh my god. Oh, we actually put off a dodge. Oh, we actually- No, no, no! Dodge! Oh my god. This is actually harrowing right now. This is so hard to explain how off this feels. Like, I, I wish I could explain to you guys how off this feels. It's such an awkward controller to hold. Oh my god, I'm just trying to go straight. I just want to go straight. If this controller will actually let me run straight, that will be a miracle in itself. Okay. Okay, we're doing alright. We're doing alright. We got the grass, grass crest shield. We only died, what was that, once to the Black Knight? Oh my god, I'm honestly... Oh my god, this is so bad. The problem is, it's such a, like, a fast-paced game as well, it's hard for me to react on time to what is actually happening. Like, I'm actually just trying to run straight. I have not moved... Oh my god, go up. Oh my god, this is great! You know what? Dark Souls, like, challenge runs and speed runs, if you guys want, like, a hell of an experience, get yourselves, like, a $5 controller off of eBay and see how you go. Little Aggie... I, I want to see you play the game with this controller. It's at the start of the video. You can have a look at it. Just match the eBay list. I'm trying to go... Oh my god, just... Oh my god, we're running straight. Alright, nope, we're not. We're not running... Oh my god, just run straight. Please, just run straight! Just run straight! <laughs> it's so bad, I hate it! Uh... Should we add another level to this? Let's add another level to this. Every time I die, I'm gonna have a shot. I'm gonna have a shot. I'll take a shot every time I die. Because my suffering isn't enough already. Let's put alcohol on top of it, I say. Okay. I, I managed to go straight for like a little while and then it just goes horribly wrong. Like, it just goes horrible. Like, oh my god, I'm literally just- I want to go straight. I just want to go straight. This is my usual run of Dark Souls, mind you. Like, I'm not changing any, like, parameters to what I usually do, just because I wanted this to be as close to possible to what I usually play. So... <clears throat> oh my god, it's so bad. It's so bad. It's so bad! Can we... Thank you. We can, Oh my god, don't go up. Oh, I'm so glad that didn't put the wrong skills in. This is my usual run of Dark Souls 1, is putting nothing but strength. Uh, because I, I, I think it's way more fun playing the game like this. Depraved with a club only putting strength, because the club perfectly scales with strength. So, oh my god, just go straight, please. This is like the most sensitive joystick I have ever used in my freaking life. Oh, we got a backstab! We actually got a backstab. Backstabs are like an actual achievement right now. Like, usually they're easy as hell to pull off. Oh, that actually connected. Oh, I was so... And <clears throat> these buttons require... Like, this is like hair trigger. This is hair trigger. They require, like, barely any pressure to actually register anything. So, it's fun. It's great fun. It's great fun. Oh, I love feeling like I'm only half in control of every game I'm playing. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! Holy shit, I love feeling like I'm only half controlling what I'm doing. Just go straight. Just please, for the love of God, do what I tell you to do. Please. This is what a $5 controller gets you, ladies and gentlemen. This is a five, whole five Australian dollars worth of controller right here. So while I'm on the elevator, I'm going to take a shot just because I did die to that Black Knight once. <laughs> oh, the first shot's always the worst. God oh, damn it, why did I jump off there? I want to do this. I want to do it this way. This is my straight, like, usual playthrough of Dark Souls 1. I'm not changing any parameters. This is how I usually run the game. This is how I always run Dark Souls 1. So, in order to make this feel as, like, authentic and easy to compare as, like, humanly possible, I'm doing my- oh my god, just go straight. It's so hard just to go straight. 
I just want to fucking go straight. Oh my god. So like I said, usually it takes me about like 45 minutes to get to Anor Londo using like a proper controller, using this particular sort of route that I take. I'm deviating just a little bit because I feel like I need... Oh my god, just go... If I fall off here, I'm going to scream. Thank you. Oh my god. Like, I'm doing slight deviations to my usual path just because I feel like I'm going to need more humanity. I feel like I'm going to need more souls. So, oh my god. I did not tell that to go over just then. The D-pad, man. Oh my god, the D-pad is so bad, man. This is, like... If Fisher-Price made a controller, this is what I imagine it would feel like. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're getting there. The Fisher-Price controller is, um... Like, it's doing... It's doing as... It's doing as good of a job as it possibly bloody can at this point, guys. Come on, reverse hollowing. Thank you. Humanity restored. Ba -da 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 -da. All right, let's go upgrade the Estus Flask. So if you don't upgrade health at all, you do not touch health in a run. Um, a plus two Estus Flask is your entire health bar. I'm not even joking. A, if you get two Firekeeper Souls and upgrade your Estus Flask just two times, that is your entire health bar. And the reason that I do... The particular route and setup that I do is because the Grass Crest Shield, when you don't touch your stamina... Oh man, is it a lifesaver. Like, just having the ability to regen your stamina a little bit faster... It makes a world of difference. Look at Raylan. Isn't she pretty? Isn't Raylan pretty, guys? Comment down below. Hashtag pretty Raylan. This is my usual character, my usual build, my usual run, my usual route... Screw the Tauros demons, like, I don't care about doing all those fights, I've done them a bajillion times. Um, last time I played this game, I went to Ash Lake first, so that was pretty fun. Though, yeah, that's a, that's another fun one, if you, oh my god. I actually have to use, I actually feel like I have to lock on, I usually don't lock on this much. Oh my god, can we please, CAN WE PLEASE?! I usually, like, rarely ever use the lock-on ability. I feel like I actually need to use it right now. Because it is impossible to just jump and do a, uh, do a th jumping attack straight. <clears throat> there we go. We're good. We're good. We're getting there. Oh my god, just go straight. I'm doing tiny movements and it's... Oh my fucking god. I'm doing the most minuscule movements, mind you. Like, this is nothing. This is the most sensitive controller. Do you ever play Call of Duty and put, like, the mouse sensitivity up to, like, absolute maximum? And then you've got, like, one of those cool, like, Logitech, like, G502 mice. And you can, like, put the DPI up to, like, 10,000. That's what these thumbsticks feel like. Okay, yeah, get up the stairs. Please get up the stairs. This is the worst experience. I love it. Oh my god, I love it. This is this might actually become my new favorite challenge run. See if I can beat the whole game using this piece of crap Fisher Price controller. <clears throat> so it's like five dollars Australian. I think that's like three dollars USD, something like that. It's fairly cheap. I know that much. I think these control. I don't know how. Like, I, I legit don't, do not know how. I do not know how. These, last time I checked, because I was like, oh my god, I want to buy another one of these controllers so that I can do, like, a two-player game where both of us are using one of these. These controllers are now, like, $12. How did they go up in price? How the hell did they... You know what, Solaire? You can join me for this, because I actually think I'm going to need you. I actually think I'm going to need Solaire for the Gargoyles. That's, uh, that's... It's been a while. It's been a while. Come on, skip. Skip. There's like eight face buttons, and I'm still, like, confused as to which one is actually supposed to be, like, the start button, and which one's, like, a weird, like, miscellaneous button. 
Oh, I'm pressing the buttons, the input delay, man. Solaire, take over for a sec. I need the heals. I need those sick heals. Oh my god. I actually need to heal. On the gargoyles. The gargoyles of all things. Oh, we got a second gargoyle coming. We got a second gargoyle coming. Uh, mm, let's move back. Let's move back. This is... This is actually quite the experience, I must say. I think this could be a category all of its own. $5 controller run. Oh, listen to how chunky that click sounds. Hang on, I'll hold it up to the microphone after I actually, like, do this battle because I do not want to leave anything to chance right now. Solaire, how have you not taken this dude out, man? Use your friggin' spear. Use your lightning spear. There we go. I'll, I'll, I'll take care of him for you. Alright. Listen to how chunky the click on this is. That's the sticks. The sticks on this thing are so, like... <coughs> like, they're so loud. Ah, uh, we almost had a perfect straight... Straight run. We almost had a perfect running straight in a straight line for three whole seconds. Ugh, we almost had it, guys. We almost had it. How's the camera going? <clears throat> oh, I'm doing. I, I'm. I have not had to like tap a thumbstick in order to do the camera movements in such a long time. It feels alien to me. And, um, by the way, I can't see my souls counter right now because of where my microphone's seated in order to record the audio, which is fine because it's where I always sit it. But considering the controller I'm using, it's adding a whole new level of... I don't know if I'm able to level up or not, and I love it! Oh, I love it! Yep, give me that. Give me that gesture. Give me that gesture, baby. Okay, D-pad. D-pad. Come on. I clicked you. I did not click you that many times, bro. Chill out. I did not click you that many times, D-pad. Chill out, bro. Oh, I did not mean to jump down. Oh, I'm seriously having such a hard time controlling this. Oh, hey, bro. You back up here. Okay, um... Yep, that's what uh, trying to do a straight jump attack into him looks like. For those of you that were curious, that's what that looks like. I'm gonna go back and grab my shit. God damn it. Alright, let's go attempt number two on killing that guy. I actually forget what his name is in the game. I feel slightly embarrassed that I don't know his name. Okay, okay. We made it into the elevator. We made it into the elevator. We're all good. Let's pop a humanity. Because after I after I get my souls back and I kill this guy, I, I actually do want to go level up because I want to go kill Quailag. I actually do want to, like... Oh my god! Holy fuck! Fuck, can you just log on? Like, lock on! Lock the fuck on, bro! There we go, we got a kill. That is the hardest enemy thus far, man. Okay, let's try these guys without locking on. We're not gonna lock on once. We're gonna try and actually... Do these guys the way I normally would do them. Okay, we're doing good so far. We're actually doing good so Oh my god. Magic. That's a magic. I didn't want to attack the wall. I did not want to attack the wall. Attacking the wall is the least of things I wanted to do. Okay, let's... This is insane. This is like a new... Oh my god. This is... Oh my god! I'm clicking the button. Just roll, man. Just roll! Oh, I didn't click it twice! I clicked it once! I clicked it once! 
She took two flasks! I clicked it once! Oh, ah! Oh. oh, come on. Let's do another swig. We actually need another swig right now. I'm, I swear to God, I'm not playing this up. I am trying my absolute hardest right now. I am actually trying my absolute hardest right now. This run does not end until I get to Anna Londo. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Let's go level up and let's go fight. Uh, let's go down to Blight Town and let's try and get Quayleg going. I'm, I'm really not, like, playing this up. This is actually just me trying to play the game normally. I will... I will do another run using my normal controller, just to show you, like, how much more proficient it is. I won't do the same level run, like, I'm not gonna do the whole thing twice for two videos. I'll just do, like, a... I'll go kill that guy. I'll kill the trident guy, um, in, like, two hits. Like, perfectly, hopefully. I don't wanna, like, you see, now that I say it, I'm gonna screw it up, because I know that's what's gonna happen, because that's just my luck. And we are not... Oh, whoops. I need to reverse... I need to reverse Halloween. Um, I'm not going to save the guy and get the Ring of Favor, because I feel like that would take away from what I'm trying to accomplish here. So, you get to live. You can give me your coin, though. Thank you. We're not going to kill him, because I actually want to do his quest line. His quest line is very fun. For those of you who don't know what his quest line is, um, after you defeat, like, Orenstein and Smoe, you go back to Anor Londo, like, later on, after you get the Lord... I believe it's after you get the Lord Vessel, you go back to Anor Londo... And you go to the way to get to Ar Orenstein and Smo, and he will invade you with two other guys. And, yeah, it's a, actually a fun quest if you can t kill them all, because uh, he kills the Firekeeper. She'll be dead next time I go back, I guarantee it. So he'll kill the Firekeeper, and then if I allow him to invade me in Anor Londo and I win, um, I can bring the Firekeeper back. And she is more powerful and more rockin' than ever. Because she got that rockin' bod, yo. Alright, these guys are gonna be another... Oh my god, can you just run straight? Can you just run... Just RUN STRAIGHT! Okay. That's out of my system. These guys will be another test, because usually I'm not too bad at getting consistent backstabs on these dudes. Upgrading, like no health runs is a really good way to learn the mechanics of the game utterly and thoroughly. But do be careful of this spot right here. You can get stuck in there if he gets in front of you. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good. We're actually doing good. We're actually doing good on this guy. We're actually doing good on this guy. These guys also drop the big club, like the really big club. I hope one of them will drop it this run, because it's good fun. It's actually amazing. It's probably the most fun weapon in the game. Next to Smile's Hammer. So, the, the, the great club that these guys use, you can turn into Smile's Hammer if you get his soul. And it's, it breaks the game. If you do an only strength build, Smile's Hammer breaks the goddamn game. It's so fun. Like, it's better than the Dragon Greatsword, I would argue, in terms of just pure damage output. Please. Ah, oh, dung part. Oh, I hate the dung part. It's a low drop rate. I will say it is a, it's a low percent, like, drop to get the Great Club. Okay. Nope, that's not a backstab. That's a backstab. Camera. Okay. Okay. Oh no. Oh, dodge, please, baby. Please, dodge. My god. This input delay is bad. It's real bad. Oh, good. We only used one, uh, one Estus flask that time. 
instead of fucking two for no reason. Thanks for that game, by the way, making me use two. If I could run straight, I feel like if I could actually just make her run the direction I want to run, this would be the easiest thing. Like, this controller would be good. This controller would be good if only I could move straight. So, it's at the point where I'm just, I'm gonna lock on to every enemy at this point, I think, because... I think if I don't lock on, I'm actually screwed. Because it's really hard to line up hits playing this way. Thank you, Mosquito. Okay, we're going this... Okay, oh my god, oh my god. Go straight, go straight, please. How do you make a joystick this sensitive? How do you make a joystick this sensitive? Someone, please tell me. I need to know. How you make a joystick this sensitive so I can mass, like, produce the greatest controller ever that has zero input lag, the best buttons, but the, but the joysticks are just, like, so sensitive that it'll shoot you off into space. I want the DPI of my joysticks to be 10,000. If it's below 10,000 DPI joystick, I don't want it. Oh, good, she's invaded me. Good, 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 good. That's what I want. I need her. But not while I'm poisoned. While I'm poisoned may be an issue. Um, can we lock on? Thank you. Oh, no. Oh, she didn't go for the follow-up attack. Usually she goes for a follow-up attack after that. Thank you. Boom, bam, bop. Bada, bop, bop, boom, bam. Sweet. We're good. We're golden. Okay. Okay. We're not... We're not doing too bad. If... It's just the D-pad and the joysticks, man! Holy mother of God! Ugh. 28 strength. Yeah, we're getting there. Usually 30 is ideal for Quaylag, I find. But you know what? Beggars cannot be choosers when they're using a $5 controller. If you're not using a $5 controller, you're not... Like, get on my level. Get on my level! Thanks, Bay. This is, this is going to be a real, this going to be like a real fun time, isn't it? Oh, just go straight, please. I'm doing the most tiny movements possible to try, there we go. That's a smooth movement. That's a smooth, that's as smooth as we're going to get. That's as smooth as we're going to get. That's why moving 0 0.05 nanometers on the actual joystick. I feel like I'm kind of getting used to it a little bit. I say as I start wildly running into... Nope. Nope. Damn it, controller! Just when I think I've got you figured out, you go ahead and pull the shit. You go ahead and pull the shit on me. Go that way. Thank you. Thank you. Let's just get to full health before we go into this, I think. Because I feel like we're going to need it. Yep, there she is. Man, I Mildred. My girl. Yep, skip, skip, skip. If I can figure out which one of these is a skip key. Okay, I'm really trying to dodge. I'm sorry if it really feels like I'm playing this up. I'm really not playing this up. I am trying my fucking hardest. I'm actually trying my absolute hardest right now. How's that poison? The poison's like almost gone, thank Christ. Uh, 
Oh my god, I got stuck in a wall. I got stuck in a wall while trying to move left. I was just going straight backwards. I was clicking left on this terrible tiny thumbstick. Oh my god, just can we please just go straight? Please, please, for the love of God, just let me run straight once and I will deem you a good controller. I will deem you a good controller if I can just run straight perfectly once. If I can run straight to the entirety of, like, of the lead up, I will deem you a good- I'm- you're already failing. You're ALREADY FAILING! For fuck's sake, how hard is it just to run straight, man? How hard is it, man? This controller is so huge and awkward. Like, in your hands. And yet the thumbsticks are like Nintendo 3DS thumbsticks. They're tiny. There's nothing to them. They're terrible. Just like the 3DS. You know what? That's an insult. The 3DS feels better than this shit. Okay, we're going. We're going. We're getting there. We're getting there. I'm not grabbing that item. You just can quell it. Clench the sphincters. It ain't getting grabbed. I'm more worried about just being able to beat Quaylag at this point. I just want to beat Quaylag. Oh, f shit. I didn't take a shot. I need to take a shot. Hang on. Let's just get up here where it's safe. Do, 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 do. Oh, my God. Just please. Please do it. Small movement! Stop using big ones. Oh, okay. That's another shot down. Man, I like vodka, but it don't go down easy. Uh, no. Go over that way, thank you. I legitimately clicked the left D-pad button four times and it didn't move. Do you have any idea what it means to click a button four times for nothing to happen? Well, my friend, you haven't used the Fisher-Price controller. Oh my god. Oh, I should not be alive. I should not be alive. I shouldn't be alive after that. That was dangerous. That was very dangerous. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, don't target me. Don't target me. Target Mildred. Target Mildred. She loves you. See? She's hitting you. That was a very poor attempt of going straight. Oh, we actually got a hit! We got a perfect hit! That was perfect! Oh, that was a perfect hit and I feel like it was a fluke. I feel like it was a fluke. Never in my life have I used a controller where getting a hit, just a normal hit, feels like it was pure fluke luck. Come on. Heal up. Heal up. Heal up. Yes. Nope. That was not the button. That was not the button that I clicked. I did not click the heavy attack button. I did not click the heavy attack. I do not want the heavy attack right now. Okay, she's gonna do an AoE. Every time she lays down like that, she's getting ready for that AoE. And I'm not gonna lie, I, I don't like it. It hurts. Yeah, we got us. What was that? Second attempt? Two attempts at Quaylag because we got uh, we got stuck on a wall because the controller thought I was pressing uh, backwards on the joystick when I was clicking all directions. Can can we? Why are you going backwards? Why did she go backwards for a? This is so sensitive. This is unfathomably sensitive. You've got no freaking clue. But on the bright side, where it sends fortress, yay! Sends fortress. Can we? Can we please, gang? Okay, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing. We're doing. We're doing it. We're doing. We're doing it. We're run. We're we're attempting to go straight, but we. I'm gonna stand still for a sec. And now we're. 
And now we're attempting... You know, fuck it, I give up. Oh, we went straight! We went straight! We went straight. We did it. We did it. That was perfect. That was actually perfect. You're probably wondering why I'm using all my humanities. It's for a very good cause. Usually I would have, like, ten coming into this, but, uh, we died on Quailag. Yep. Hurry up. Yep. Uh, the only reason I enter this covenant and offer my humanities is just so I can get the, um, the light that is very, very helpful. It, like, so helpful in the, um, the Tome of the Giants. Okay, Allegiance Deepened. Ah, uh, yeah, I think it's 10 in order to actually gain rank, though. And now, I should... I should be able to use a Homeward Bone, but... Oh my god, it's it's hard just to use items. It's hard just to use items, man. It's hard, man. It's hard. Holy crap, can you imagine playing... Oh my... I'm not that great at Elden Ring yet. I haven't put like a billion hours into it yet, like I have with this game. Can you imagine trying to like play Elden Ring with a $5 Fisher-Price controller? That would actually be torture. That would be a nightmare. Okay, we avoided the... We avoided the poison, but I don't know if we're going to be able to avoid falling off. And we are already on our way to Sen's Fortress. This is... Once I reach Anor Londo is where this ends, because I refuse... I, I refuse to fight Orenstein and Smo. With this controller. I refuse. I'm not fighting Orenstein or Smo. Really? 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 Thank you. Just when I think. Just when I think that we're gonna be okay. That shit happens. We got nothing. We got no armor. I thought we got a gargoyle helm. No. Nope. Didn't get the gargoyle helm. I love the Gargoyle Helm. My usual character is literally just this with a Gargoyle Helm. <laughs> Raylan only rocks headgear, guys. She don't... She don't mess with no armor. Because armor equals fat rolls, and fat rolls equal not being able to do their mad dodges. See, look at this. She's an acrobat. Raylan's an acrobat, guys. You can't restrict Raylan with clothing. She needs to be free to, to roll around like a fucking lunatic. Because she is one. Okay. We're good. We're good. If that happens again, th then this wheel might be impossible. If that happens again, this might be impossible to get off of. I don't know what happened. Like, I don't know what happened. There we go. There we go. We did it. We're good. We're good. You know what? It's literally just because I can't go the direction I want to go when I want to go. It's just because I can't go the direction I want to go when I want to go. I, I can't. It's impossible. Oh, 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 we're getting there. Oh, we're getting there. Oh, we're doing it. Oh, we're doing it. Oh, we're climbing the ladder flawlessly. We're going to get toxic. Oh, oh, that was close. Oh, we almost got toxic. Toxic would have actually just ruined this whole run. Toxic would have ended this run. Because I doubt I'm gonna get lucky a second time on the, um, the spinning wheel. Because at this point, that's what it is. This, this is not a skill run anymore. This is, this is a luck run based on whether or not the controller wants to, wants to do, wants to do as I say. I, I say as I'm, like, struggling to go straight again. And, like, you guys are watching this, and you're probably thinking, like, oh, wow, he's, like, he's crap. Nah, man. Nah, man. You gotta use this, you gotta use this thing to know how bad it feels. I've played this game with a fucking Guitar Hero controller, mind you. Like, an actual Guitar Hero controller. I think it was better than this. Okay. Okay, don't fall. Don't fall. We're good. We're good. We're doing it. Oh, we're doing it! Yay! We're gonna beat... We're gonna... We're gonna beat... Um... Something. 
we're gonna beat the I am golem and then I'm gonna end this run because oh my god this is torture at this point why do I do this to myself I love this game why would I subject myself to I'm gonna stand still I'm gonna line the camera up and we're just gonna tap we're just gonna tap we're gonna tap there we go if we tap we can go straight if we tap we can go straight guys see we're going straight you ruined it I was if we do this we can go straight we're going straight we're doing it we're finally in control we're finally in control of the character we were in control of the character but I feel like if I was stepping the whole time we would not be in control of anything yeah see cool he killed her thank you thanks bro Thanks for killing the fire keeper. I'm glad I've already got 10 Estus flasks or I'd be in trouble. Alright, let's go to Sen's Fortress. Let's go to Sen's Fortress. Usually, what is like a karma part of the run is going to become the hardest part of the run, I guarantee it. Sen's Fortress is going to be the hardest part of this whole run. Because it's going to be really hard to line up backstabs on the snake dudes. I'm not using any of the correct names for the enemies in this game because, like, I can't be bo Oh, I didn't take a shot when I died on the wheel. Give me a sec. There we go. Sense Fortress is going to be the hardest part of this whole run. Oh, we were going straight. We're going straight. We're doing it. We're doing it. Oh, there's a little bit, a little bit, a little bit of, a little bit of wiggle. Little bit of wiggle, but we get we did, no little bit of Okay, this is Okay. I just please just give me a fine movement. That's all I'm asking for, game. I'm not asking for much. I'm really not asking for much. I'm not asking for much, man. Just give me like three levels. Oh we're good. No, that's even better, that's five levels. Okay, you guys ready for the hardest part of this whole run? I'm trying to go straight across the f fucking pendulaxes. Okay, if I don't look at the screen, am I going straight? I'm not looking at the screen right now. I'm kind of, okay, I'm kind of going straight. No, I'm not even attempting. I'm not even attempting, you guys. You guys can live. I'm not even going to make the attempt right now. Oh, that was close. That was close. If I can kill this guy... Oh my god. No! Why did you dodge roll? Why did you dodge roll? Oh, I didn't even click the button. Oh, why did you dodge roll, man? Why? Why? Oh, why? You can get past him without rolling. Why did you roll? Oh, no. Okay. How, how light is the... Zero pressure. Zero pressure. Oh, my God. Just me resting my thumb on the button was enough to proc the roll. Oh, it's like, z this is like hair trigger, man. This is playing with a controller that only requires 0.5 grams of pressure in order to click any button. I'm not even gonna worry about it. There's no point even getting them souls back. Oh, this is not even worth it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no! No! I, I tried to roll straight. I tried my fucking hardest to just roll straight. I just wanted to roll straight, not at an angle. I'm not going to look at the screen. I'm just going to close my eyes. And you guys can tell me if I went straight or not. You know what? By the fact that I've opened my eyes and I'm on a different side of the, the bridge. No, I did not. I did not run straight. I did not run straight. Oh, this is... 
Oh, this is torture. Oh, yes! Okay, you know what? Victory. We made it up one staircase. That was a straight run up a staircase. That is vi that is victory. We beat we did it, guys. We beat we beat Cinder. Like we've done it. We beat Gwyn. We beat Gwyn. We beat Sif. We beat Artorius. We've beaten uh, Orenstein and Smo. We've we've beaten the Iron Golem. We've beaten the whole game because we got up, we got up a fucking staircase without the oh my god deviation to the controls is what I'm trying to say. Let's get on full health. This is going to be hard because this actually requires being able to roll in the direction I'm facing. Okay. 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 We did it. 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 Oh my god, we actually did it. That is the first time I have actually been able to control. That is the first time I've been able to control a roll. Oh, this is going to suck, though, because this is such a precision. This is such precision right here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Run, 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 run. There we go. We did it. I feel like we did it. We did it. Okay. This is going to... This is going to suck. This is going to suck! Can we get a backstab? We got a backstab. We're good. We're golden. We're golden. Iron Golem, coming for you, baby. Coming for that Iron Golem. Okay, dodging is, uh, it's not as, uh, it's not ideal. It's not ideal trying to, like, do a precise dodge. I'll give it that. Oh, God. Okay, I'm gonna wait for the next boulder because this is gonna require all of my focus. This is gonna require all of my focus thanks to controller from Fisher Pry and we fucked it. And we fucked it. And we fucked it. How much pressure is the control of the thumbstick community? Okay, so it's like 5.5 grams on everything on this controller. I'm gonna die. You ready for this? Boulder's gonna get me. Oh! Oh! Oh, that was so fucking close! That was, like, oh, that was so close. That was so close. Holy shit. Oh, that was... Oh, that was... That was a clencher. That was a clencher. Now for the real challenge. Now for the real challenge. Go. Go. No, don't fall off. Oh, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Somehow we're good. Somehow we're good. It can't handle a basic input, but it can handle that. And that's a win. Can we... Can we please... Can we please... CAN WE PULL A- NO! When I want to dodge, it doesn't dodge. When I don't want to dodge, it dodges. <laughs> this is two shots. Two shots, I think. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'll just... Every time I get the controller in the perfect spot to go straight, every time it just doesn't. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Can we please? Alright, I'm gonna try my fucking hardest to go straight up these stairs. That was legit concentration just to go straight. And I actually did it. Okay. 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 We're kind of... We're getting somewhere. See you, Snakey. Dodge roll. Oh, we dodge rolled... We actually dodge rolled in the direction I wanted to dodge roll for once. We actually dodge rolled. Guys... You have, you have no idea how much of an achievement it legitimately is to do a BASIC input on this controller. Just doing a basic input is like torture. I didn't even... I couldn't even do anything. I was hitting the buttons. I was clicking the sticks. We're not... We're not moving. 
Holy shit, we're not moving. Hang on, I need to unplug and replug the controller. I think it just died. Okay. Are we moving? Are we... Okay, we're back! Sweet, we're back! Okay, the can... Oh my god. Oh my god, the... I'm gonna stop moving for a sec. The controller just cut out completely. I have unplugged it and replugged it. And check this out. This is legitimately me just pushing straight on the thumbstick. I'm not causing this. Well, I, that's... Just hang on. I'm gonna unplug it and plug it back in and see if it makes any difference. How many times do you have to make the fucking noise to verify? Okay. Okay, we're doing... Okay, we're not... We're not doing as... Okay. Okay, the controllers... It's kind of working again. So... Five dollars not only gets you the Fisher-Price controller... But it gets you... Get this. A controller with intermittent crashes and cutouts. And as far as I'm concerned... That makes it the best controller I've ever used. I love when my controller randomly cuts the fuck out and I have to unplug it and plug it back in three goddamn times in order to get it to work again. This is like... Can your Xbox One controller give you intermittent uh, crashes that need a kind of full controller reboot? I didn't think so. Oh my fucking god. I'm click... I'm, I swear I'm not doing this on purpose. I'm clicking the roll button. I'm clicking the roll button. Hang on, okay. So I'm just tapping it. Nothing's happening. If I hold it though, now we're sprinting. I've released it and now we're not sprinting. So why, why isn't it? I'm just going to mash the fuck out of this. Give me a sec. Hang on, give me a sec. I'm going to unplug it. Okay. It's unplugged. I'm gonna do this. Okay. Hopefully now all the buttons are unstuck. Hopefully now all the buttons are unstuck. Are we good? We're good? We're good? We're moving? Okay. Oh, camera. Camera, please. I just wanna go up and down. I just wanna... Okay. Okay. Okay! We're actually able to move just up and down smoothly on the camera. That's a first. Oh, tapping the button works. Tapping the button works. We're actually able to run kind of straight. So, I, I guess the key to the Fisher-Price controller is you have to unplug it and plug it back in 15 times while you're playing it. And uh, randomly, while playing, you need to unplug it and mash the ever-loving thing fuck out of every single button on the controller in order to get them to work again. Oh, I thought I was going to fall off the edge for a second then. Oh, that was harrowing. Oh, that was harrowing. That was harrowing. Okay. Are we good? I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. Oh my god, we're good. We're good. Okay. Just wait for the lightning... No! Oh, I clicked dodge! I clicked the fucking roll button! Oh, this is dodge! <laughs> oh, maybe I should have gotten the ring of favor and protection, but no, I wanted to do the quest! I wanted to do the quest! Hang on. Is that two or three shots that I have to take now? I'm ta You know what? Fuck it, I'm taking a swig. Oh! Oh! Oh, you gotta love that fucking fermented potato. Oh, Russian people, how? How? How do you drink a full bottle of this shit all every night, man? Maybe I just got cheap shit. Maybe I need like a really expensive bottle of vodka to get it. Okay. Okay. This is the first time in a... You know what? You know what? 
this is the first time since my first run of Dark Souls ever that I've had to take these Pendulaxes slow. Like, methodically slow. I feel like I'm playing for the first time ever again. Oh, I'm not even... If anyone wants to feel like they're reliving their first ever playthrough of Dark Souls 1 Sens Fortress, buy a Fisher-Price controller. It's doing a good job. I actually don't think I'm going to be able to beat Sans Fortress at all. I don't think I'm going to be able to beat it at all. I'm clicking the buttons, I'm hitting the sticks, I'm doing all of the stuff that one would do in order to get in order to get past that and I can't. I just I can't. Like I can't. I got past it once. And I'm beginning to think that that first time I got past that was actually just a pure fluke. Like, it wasn't luck, it wasn't skill, it was just fluke. Like, there is no way in hell you can recreate it, you can't replicate it. Like, it's impossible to replicate getting past it at this point. I'm gonna give this three more attempts just on these axes right here. If it takes me three attempts and I still can't get past just these axes- Oh my god. OH MY GOD! OH YES! 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 HOLY MOTHER OF GOD YES! YES! HOLY SHIT! I just feel like I beat Gwen for the first time ever again! That is... Oh! I can't even describe how good that feels. I can't even describe how good that- I'm fucking out of here, though. I'm out of here, man. I ain't doing it again. I ain't doing it again, man. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I ain't doing it again! I ain't doing it again! No! No! This isn't done until I beat the Iron Golem, man. This isn't done until I beat the Iron Golem, man. I'm doing- I'm so committed to doing this Iron Golem right now, man. Come on! Just come on, man! Come the fuck on! That was- you know what? I'm not even gonna blame the controller. That was my fuck up. That was my fuck up. I should've just killed him. I should've just killed him, man. Oh, I hate it. I hate this controller. After this video, I'm never using it again. I'm ne I swear to fuck, I'm never using it again. This is delegated to, like, player two when a five-year-old comes over and I don't want to give him, a, like, an expensive controller. Don't, don't fall, don't fall. <laughs> I can't go straight. Like, I can't roll straight, no matter how hard I try. I'm trying so hard, man. I'm calling it. If I can't get to the bonfire before the Iron Golem, five attempts. Oh my god, we actually... We're going straight. Did me smashing the control... Did me... Punching the controller after that last death make it possible to kind of go straight. I'm calling it, man. I'm calling it five more. I'm only giving it five more attempts starting now. If I can't get to that bonfire, if I can't get to the next bonfire in the next five attempts, that's it, we're done. I'm calling it. I'm not subjecting myself or you guys 
to any more of this shit. Oh no! 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 Come on! Come on! Four left! Four attempts! Four left! Four left! Fisher Price controller! Four attempts left. Four left. That's it. I'm calling it, man. If I can't get to that bonfire in the next four attempts, we're just done. I'm kind of going straight now, though. Like, there's very little deviation. I guess smashing the controller fixes the fish. Oh my god, it all makes sense now. It all makes sense now. Fisher Price smashing it. Toddlers love to break things. If I break the controller worse than it's already broken, then Fisher Price themselves will give me an endorsement. Ugh, just get off there, man! Okay. Okay. Oh, I felt like I was gonna fall again. Oh, that felt like we were falling again. I'm not. I'm not taking any chances. Now. 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 Oh, that should have hit the axe. That should have hit the axe. No! 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 I'm hitting dodge. I swear to fuck, I'm hitting. I swear to fuck. I'm trying so hard. Three. Three left. Three left. I'm not drinking no more. I've had five shots. I've had five shots and I'm not... I'm not feeling anything. Nothing at all. But I'm not risking it. I'm not risking getting any form of buzz and making me play worse. Okay. Come on. We got three attempts left. Just let me pass the fucking lightning serpent at least, man. At least! It, it just goes to show that first time I got passed, that was 150% pure fucking luck. There is no skill involved in this game anymore. There's no skill involved in this game anymore. The Fisher Price controller has taken all of the skill out of the game. Yes! Come on! Come on! Yes! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, I'm feeling it! I'm feeling it! This is the one! This has to be the one! This has to be the one! Just let me get to the bonfire, please! Please just let me get to the bonfire. I just want to get to the bonfire. I will feel... I will feel fucking fulfilled if I can just get to that bonfire. Or if I can just, if I can just clench it. If I can clutch it. If I can make it to the bonfire. If I can just make it to the bonfire. It'll all be worth it. I'm just, I'm not taking chances. You're dead. You're dying, mate. You're fucking dying. I'm not taking any chance on this. I'm gonna play this like surgery if I have to. If I have to play this like surgery to get that bonfire, I'm doing it. I just want the nightmare to end. I want Fisher Price to go bankrupt. Okay. 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 Wait for the next boulder. Wait for the next boulder. Wait for the boulder. Come on. I'm putting all of it. All of it is into this run. All of it's into this run. Oh, Castlevania. Yes! Oh, we fucking did it. Oh, we did it. We did it. All right. Activate the trap. Now back off. Uh, judge rolled into the wall, but it still works. It still works. Okay. 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 I have to play this so carefully now. This is the most careful I think I've ever had to play this game. And it's all thanks to a Fisher Price controller. Okay. Has he seen us? He has. Alright, we have to kill him. We have to kill him. We have to just kill. Every enemy that gets procced by us now at this point. It has to. I just, I have to. I can't play this the way I normally play this game. 
I have to be so careful now. So careful now. Oh my god. If I can do it. If I can do it. If this is the one. If this is the one. Please let this be the one. Just let me get to the bonfire. We've got three attempts left at Sen's Fortress. Three. None more, none less. Three. We've got three attempts left at Sen's Fortress. Please let this be the one that at least gets lets me get to the bonfire. Please let this be the one. I want to feel everyone's energy. Please, everyone, give me your energy. Hold your hands up to the sky like, like you're giving me energy for a spirit bomb. Like I'm Goku going Super Saiyan. This is... Oh my god. No. Oh, I have to tap. I have to tap. I have to... Jump! Oh my god. Oh my god. Please. Please. Just let me get to the bonfire. This is it. This is it. Please. Please. Oh, just run straight. Just give me one thing game. Please. Oh my god, we did it! Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Rest at bonfire. Oh. I have three attempts to beat the Iron Golem now. Three. Do you, that doesn't sound daunting. That sounds like an easy time. That's the easiest time you could ever have playing this game. The Iron Golem is easier than any other boss. It's easier than the Taurus Demon. Three attempts sounds like a lot. Nah. You got no idea. You've got no idea. Three attempts is nothing when you're playing with a Fisher-Price controller. It, like, it's nothing. Three attempts is nothing. Okay. Okay. Okay, camera, camera, control, don't you dare fall, don't you dare fall, don't fall please, oh we're so fucking close, we're so close, just get out of the way, get out of the fucking way man, get out of here, I don't want, okay, we have four Estus flasks, let's just get all the jank out right now, let's get all the jank out of this controller right now. Three attempts to beat this guy. We're almost there. I've we're almost there. Please don't. Oh my god, I clicked dodge way before it actually dodged. The input delay is so bad. Input delay, please. Please. No. No! Oh thank fuck. Thank fuck. Thank fuck. No. 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 Two attempts. Do I attempt to kill the giant? I have to kill the giant. I'm gonna have to do it. I have to. I have to. I have to kill the giant or else I'm not getting through this. This fight is usually so easy. It's usually so easy with or without the giant. I didn't... I didn't double tap. I swear to fuck. This fight, with or without the giant, is usually so easy. This is so hard. I have two attempts to make this happen. Two attempts to get to Anno Alondo. <sighs> Come on. Can we please make it happen? Please. I've got a lot of good karma stored up. Please just let it happen. Stop. No. Stop. 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 Just run straight. Just run straight, please. Please just run straight. Alright. We gotta kill the giant. Please. I've never wanted anything in my life as badly as I want this. I just, I need, I need to kill the Iron Golem. I need to, please. 
Come on, just hit him. Please just hit him. Just kill him. For the love of all. For the love of all. Just kill him, please, man. Oh, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Please. Please. Let this be the one. Please. I need... I need this. I need this so bad, man. I need this so bad, man. Did we get him? Okay. That's giant gone. Giant gone. Okay. Okay. We've got two tries. Two tries at the Iron Golem. I swear I'm... I swear I'm trying my hardest. I'm not playing this up. This controller has made this an entirely new game again. Like, this is a new way to play Dark Souls with a $5 Fisher-Price controller. You ever want the ultimate challenge run? eBay. Go on eBay, type in, type in controller, buy the cheapest one. Buy the cheapest one. Don't buy anything else or you're not doing it right. Cheapest controller any percent. Cheapest controller any percent is what I'm calling this. I'm so under leveled for this. I'm usually way, way higher level for this. But I'm gonna do it. No! Oh no! No, 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 no. Please. Please. I'm not going to be able to make him fall off. I can promise you I'm not going to be able to make him fall off with this setup. I don't care if he falls off. I just want him dead. That is the whole premise of this run. It's just to make him dead. Anor Londo is where this run ends. And by God, I'm going to get there. Okay. We're doing alright. Don't do 360s! Don't do 360s! Just, just go through the legs. Please. Just make something happen. Just make something happen, please. Please. Oh, please. Please. Are we gonna do it? Please do it. Please, can we do it? Please. Please let him die. Just let him die. I'm trying my fucking hardest, man. I'm trying so hard. This is not the ideal setup. This is not the ideal level. This is not the ideal strength. This is not the ideal damage. Oh my god. Oh my god, we did it. Oh my god, please. Please. I just need to get to the bonfire in Anor Londo and we're done. I just need to get to the bonfire in Anor Londo and we're done. Fisher Price controller. Don't fail me now. Please don't fail me now. We're so close. We are so close. I'm avoiding ya. I'm avoiding ya. I'm too close now. Just go straight. Please just go straight. I've come too far. I've come too far. I've come too far to admit to admit defeat. I've come too far to admit defeat. Playing Dark Souls 1 with a Fisher Price controller this is a life changing experience at this point. We did it. We did it. Done. Run done. I'm done. I'm not playing anymore. That's it. You know what? Look, look. You ready? Boom. Bam. Bop. Bam. Get ready for this. We're taking it a step further. Get ready. For some reason, I can't log into the servers to play online, and I don't know why. It hasn't let me online for like a day and a half now. Load game. That's it. One hour, 13 minutes, 36 seconds. Delete. We're done. We're never touching it again.
That's the best run I've ever had. One hour five. For Anor Londo. And look at that. Level 23. That's the best run I've ever had. Fisher Price controller. If I had have beaten an hour five. The Fisher Price controller would have been the best controller ever. It actually would have. I would have. I would have told all of you buy a $5 controller, it makes no difference. But that, that fucking thing, that fucking thing, no. No. Just no. Never again. Never again. With that, I'm going to leave you all there. Cheap control, cheapest controller, any percent, Dark Souls. Do it. Little Aggie. Little Aggie, I want to see you attempt that shit. I want to see you attempt it with a Fisher-Price controller like I just did. You're the king of these runs. Little Aggie, you are the king of all Dark Souls, Bloodborne, Elden Ring. You're the king. You are the king of runs in Soulsborne games. Use a Fisher-Price controller and get back to me, bro! I am the king now because of- because of this SHIT! I'll see you in the next episode. I hope you've enjoyed it. Bye.